In the pre-dawn twilight on a Minnesota prairie, a quiet listener may hear a kind of hum in the springtime. It's the sound of the prairie chicken here on what's known as a booming ground, a spectacle once almost lost in Minnesota. This is basically their mating ritual. Right now, we mostly, from what I can see, we mostly have males on the ground. The males arrive in early March. They spend weeks sorting out territory, creating an invisible patchwork. When they face each other like that, now they're, now they're splitting again. There's, that's a boundary for those two males in terms of where they can go. If you think this looks animated, wait till the ladies arrive. When they fly in, you'll see a lot of what's called flutter jumping. The males inflate bright orange air sacs and raise a pair of head feathers called pinnae. Then with tails erect and fanned, they do a kind of quick stomping dance. They're giving it all they got. We came to watch and take pictures. And we learned that prairie chickens are very choosy about their booming grounds. For me, the presence of prairie chickens in an area really indicates that you have a very healthy grassland system. Brian Winter of the Nature Conservancy explains that it's taken a concerted effort by public and private landowners to restore and maintain suitable grasslands, tall native grasses for nesting, surrounding an area where growth is kept short. For a male prairie chicken looking for companionship, it's all about being seen. <laughs> 